are back once again in my summer car. It's been a little bit into my last episode. I did a bunch of stuff over uh, over the last couple of days. I did, I did the wood job. I did all the poop stuff, you know. Because I don't think y'all want to watch me do that kind of stuff. It's kind of boring. You know, nothing much really happened. I did order some new parts, which I'll be ordering getting today. And I'm taking the Rusco because uh, I like pain. I like to uh, torture myself, so, you know, it's all about that, really. So we're going to go ahead, we're going to drop off the kill you to, uh, Jock, and then we're going to go and get my stuff. Hopefully, Tim will be open by the time I'm done, so, wow, first try, holy crap, that was, that's pretty good, actually, holy cow. <laughs> so, yeah, I've been kind of busy for the last couple of days, and also, I just I kind of didn't feel like recording any episodes of my summer car, honestly. I kind of got a little burnt out, I guess, so I, I decided to take a little break, I guess. Um, I'm honestly getting kind of burnt out with recording videos a little bit. And maybe I should take a little break, I don't know. But, um, I do have an update on my car, though. I got the intake and stuff all hooked up, but there is a vacuum leak. So I'm assuming that when we took off the intake manifold, we didn't completely remove the old uh, intake gasket, which was a pain in the ass to begin with to remove. So I have to, I'm going to buy a new intake gasket, new injector seals, new... Um, Probably a new valve cover gasket too, because if I think the valve cover gasket is no good because it's, it's leaking oil, so not that the car was losing oil before, you know. Um, so definitely going. And I was probably talking to just change oil too because it's black. So yeah, um, that should probably fix the issue though. Cause my 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 thought was, oh, it's the IAC, it's the idle control valve on my car. No, I think it's a vacuum leak. So, um, hopefully that will, uh, fix the issue. You know, while we're doing this, I'm going to just borrow, or I'm going to just take advantage of Jock's, uh, you know, bathroom to fill up my, uh, killed you bucket with water. The trick is to just mash the clutch. I don't have a clutch pedal with this thing, so I just mash it. And that usually does the trick, because this thing is so weak. It's so weak. It's so pitifully pathetic. There's Pina. Freaking. Is that Pina? That probably was Pina. I hope we don't run into him later on. Get run over by him like two seconds later. Might have been him, probably. I don't know. I don't care if it was him or not. He's a bitch. This thing actually, like, is... The suspension on the back of the car is so... Is so broken that... That thing weighs, like, what? Maybe 10 pounds? That, that toolkit? Like, this thing is... Yeah, it, it actually makes the suspension, like, bounce a little bit. That is so bad, dude. Ima you think, I mean, imagine this thing would loaded up with all my stuff. It's going to be like a low rider, dude. <laughs> it's going to be like, uh, what they call that? Where, like, the back end of the truck is super low, but the front... Squatted. It's going to be squatted. Like a truck. <sighs> God damn it. Oh, hang on. Here's my booze I left here a couple episodes, a couple couple days ago. I think I killed, or someone killed, um, no, I remember. I think I found, um, I found Terry by the farm, and his car wasn't anywhere to be found, but I found him, his body, and his box of booze, and it only had two bottles in it, which is weird. Usually it's about four or five, but maybe it's like a random thing that happens, you know. It's not really set in stone. But. Alright. Go ahead and buy some uh, food, too. Cause we need 
food for the road. And I think... I think that's it. I think we're all good on stuff. Yes, 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 yes. Now, the, uh, the t difficult part will be loading all this stuff, as you can see. Um, so, I'm going to probably load the biggest pack, which is the uh, racing seats, onto the top here. There we go. Bada bing. I wish we could, like, actually tie it down. Like, that would be nice, but... Maybe someday someone will make a mod. I love how it's actually perfect. It's perfectly in between the uh, bars. Well, I mean, I guess not perfectly, but you know, just just small enough to fit. So and then we just shove all the resty stuff in the back here. There we go. See, there you go. That is how you load a car. Um, I'm a bit a bit worried because, well, you know, it's a low rider now, and I'm gonna take a picture of this. Had to take a picture of it. It just looked too funny. <laughs> I you know what? I want to take a. I want to take a picture. It's a low rider now. It's a low rider, you know. It's oh yeah, dude. I got I got um, I got my new coilovers, bro. Uh, I only able to afford one side, so I got the back first. <laughs> Squatted, Rusko gang. Oh, actually, no seatbelts in this thing. <laughs> no seatbelt, gang. I'm gonna just keep it in fourth gear for the whole trip because the the lower RPMs I, I produce, the slower it'll overheat, basically. So that's kind of my my stance on the on the Rusco. You know, it's kind of hard to do that with a keyboard. I mean, because you're full throttle all the time. Granted, I'm full throttle right now, but I'm in fourth gear, so. I'm not producing as high as much higher PMs as say in third gear or second gear, so and I'm running off the gas too to like save you know stop the car from overheating as quickly, I guess. <laughs> there is a definitely a like I mean there's a way you can, you know, normally drive this car, I you know, I guess the Rusco has its own like charm to it, I suppose. Uh, I mean, I'm skipping. I'm, I keep pressing F9 to make sure my pack doesn't fall out of the top of the roof rack. <laughs> but um, it has its own kind of charm, I guess. You know. Um, it, I also think it's cool for like camping, I guess. You know, because it's got a bed. You know, you can sleep in it, and I don't know. So I'm thinking, I have more than enough money now to get the. Uh, roll cage installed on the uh, Satsuma so I think and maybe I might just go ahead and install that thing today well pay you know Futari to install it today anyway you know and I'll be one step closer to the rally so that'd be cool you know I want to get custom paint job too so maybe I'll maybe if I have enough money I might just you know bite the bullet and get the uh, custom paint job and the roll cage in one in one go you know oh yeah I forgot to mention also I did the hay bale job too I finally finished it so I imagine I'll be getting a call pretty soon about the combine harvest job and even though I've already done it my previous run and my on YouTube I do want to try it again but I want to try it differently this time I want to try it by driving on the highway now that I'm not on permadeath if I, you know, die, it's whatever, you know. But I'm going to try something different. And I'm thinking once I finish the job, I want to sell the harvester back from Tavaka and keep it at my house. It's sort of a trophy, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> It'd be kind of cool. I mean, would it be worth the effort? Probably not, you know. But it's kind of cool, I guess. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I could try to load it into the trailer and use a tractor, but I don't know. That'd be definitely an interesting idea. So, alright. <sighs> God damn it. Driving this thing is like hell. Alright, so we have our packages here. I'm just gonna take them out of the car here. I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna organize my stuff here real quick. 
and then we'll get back to it. Oh man, trying to make some more space. I'm I'm running out of space for all all this booze. You're probably like, why don't you just drink it? No, it's my my trophy. This I earned this. Well, most of it. I mean, some of it I stole from from Pitari's dead corpse, but we're not going to talk about that. <laughs> All right, so we got our packages. Here we have our racing seats. So we have the passenger seat. I don't know why they give you a passenger seat. I mean, okay, they, they do because, you know, you have passengers, but there's no seatbelt for it. So, like, if the passenger's in the car and they get in a the crash, then I guess you're dead. They're dead. So that's, that's very considerate. Uh, pro state. Yeah, I'm looking at you guys. I know it's obviously a joke about prostates because haha, -ha, butt jokes are funny. <laughs> butt jokes. Okay. Uh, let's see, what is this? This is the harness for the races. You know, I can't put it in, in the harness yet. Okay, I need to put the roll cage in, so I'll leave that right there. Uh, let's see what else we got. We got the wheels. I know this is the wheels right here, so I'm going to put these. Actually, you know what? We're gonna put these in the trunk because I do want to get these wheels um, done. So we'll probably put these in the trunk, and after I get the roll cage done, by then I'll probably have enough money for rally tires. So I will paint them though. I'm gonna paint them black. There we go. I'm pretty sure we're not gonna make it to a uh, free tire. That's fine. I mean, he, it's not like it's the weekend, you know, so we've got the whole week to get that stuff done. Alright, I think this is the window louvers. Let's see how these look. Like I said, I might put these on if I ever, like, put the uh, window tint on, which is probably what I'm going to order next. And the nitrous kit, of course, because, you know, gotta go fast, am I right? <laughs> So it's funny, one of my coworkers was like, Hey, you should take your car to Street Night. And I'm like, What's that? Oh, it's a drag race thing down at New Hampshire Speedway. And I'm like, I don't think my car is that fast. It's like, Oh, there's plenty of guys to run 17 seconds. And I'm like, I, Really? I mean, that'd be kind of cool, I guess. I mean, I think it would help me, it would help teach me how to do better launch control, I guess, which would be kind of. Because, see, sometimes it's not about having the fastest car. Sometimes it's about having good launch control too. And honestly, I am not the best at launch control. <laughs> you know, I have like, I mean, it looks nice, but it also covers up my freaking stickers, like right there. So you know what? For right now, we're gonna delete it until we like put the tint on. So we'll leave it right here, right, right over here, right, 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 right over there. There we go. Alright, and then the last thing we have is the <sighs> big boy spoiler. I'm not really a big fan of this, and I like, I actually like big spoilers. But this is one of those spoilers I cannot get along with, I guess, so. Alright, let's see. So let's put this paint back. I mean, I like big spoilers, you know. I like the big Subaru, big Wang, you know, but, uh, I don't know, this one just doesn't look, I mean, let me see here, Let's see how it looks here, Let's see how it looks, I mean, uh, it might look better with like a rally, if I had a rally paint job, it might look more appropriate, but on this, it just looks so weird. It's like it's like the right. It's like it's almost like when you have, when you're in Forza, and you have the Forza arrow option. It's like that basically. It feels like that. See the lip. The lip feels more. It feels like it, it, it's it's okay. Now I know you shouldn't. Really, it, it sounds dumb putting a spoiler on a front wheel drive car, but there is actually apparently downforce even on a front wheel drive car does have an effect on handling. So you know, I'll I'll give him that. You know, but. Uh, that's pretty much it uh, for stuff. So I'm thinking, well, he he's about he's gonna he's about ready to close. So um, we're gonna just 
Hmm. Well, I can't do much else right now. I don't have any more jobs to do. I haven't got any phone calls. So I guess I'll just skip to when I drive down to his place. So. Well, well, well. Look who it is. The freaking punks. Oh, um, hang on. Actually, you know what? Before I do anything, I'm gonna just put this in the mail real quick. gonna go ahead and uh, greet my fellow fellow street racers I don't know hold on a minute hang on damn it Oh yeah. Yeah. Let's race, bro. Let's race. I want to see if my shit bucket is faster than yours. See if uh, I can be at least Batari. I don't know. Come on, baby! Come on! Oh, God damn it! Got you now, buddy. Got you now. Ooh, come on, come on, come on. Yee -hee 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 -hee. Holy cow. No, 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 don't pass me, come on. Oh, no. Dude, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think Patari just died. I think I may have just caused him to die. Hold on. Oh, no. Uh... Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's dead. Let me just uh, put my hazards on here. Not that it matters, though. Um... Oh, yeah, he is dead. He, he is definitely dead. Um... I want to steal his booze without dying, so maybe I can just push his car out of the road. I think it's clear. Uh, hold on, maybe if I use the beer case to push it, I don't know. Nope. I can actually not use the beer case to push his car. Holy cow. Can I... Ooh! Okay, that works too. Um, that also works. Thanks, thanks, random NPC car. <laughs> oh 
<laughs> All right, let's get back in the driver's seat here, so we can move up a little closer. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> All right. I don't know where uh, Janie went. I guess he got stuck or something. I don't know. Yo, this dude. I, 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 I basically killed him. But I'm still stealing his booze. I don't have the room for it in my fridge. But, uh, you know. Man's got to got to drink, you know. God, it's terrible. Alright. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna steal this, you know. Don't mind me. Oh, when did that happen? Oh, huh. Whatever. Hit it. I think it's all the booze. Only four bottles, man. Come on, dog. I know you. I know you're holding out on me. I know you're dead, but I know you're holding out on me. You. You good? Yeah, he's fine. He'll just respawn again when I save my game. It's fine. It's fine. He's not dead for real. I, I kind of feel bad though. <laughs> I was the reason why he died because he was trying to overtake me. So that was my fault. Oh well. I'll just respawn again when I save my game. Alright, back on to the shop. I'll probably turn my hatches off, I guess. So I think Pina or Bataria might be actually slower. Um. Than Janie. Because I could never ever be Janie so but one of these days though I'm thinking I could probably be Janie if I tune my valves the right way and you know have a little uh, nitrous kick to my uh... well I just heard I think I just passed him because I heard his music playing so he must have just got stuck I guess so all right That was intense, though. That was like, dude, <laughs> that was awesome. Ooh. Okay. Somehow I didn't. I I narrowly avoided that one. Okay. All right. Not sure how that happened, but okay. That was pretty intense though, not gonna lie, that was awesome. <laughs> Alright, well. I'm actually gonna go to sleep. So, I'm gonna go to sleep and when I wake up, hopefully uh, the shop will be, or I can go to a uh, talk. Oh, wait, I don't have a, I don't have a bed back here. I gotta go to sleep in the freaking poop truck. Well, before I do, I'm gonna just make sure all my bars are down I guess alright it's about six o'clock so I'm assuming by the time we get to his shop he'll be open so I'm actually gonna go take a shower and uh, see if uh, I can take a shower at Jock's house real quick before I leave though oh wow his house is open is he home Nope. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna just take make use of his facilities and just take a shower real quick here. I mean, I did help the man move out, so you know, the least he could do is let me use his shower. You know, I mean, he did pay me though, but I mean, I'm, we're like friends. I give I give him kill you. He gives me money. Like, to be fair, I think I'm like the only friend he has, which is. Kind of sad, actually. Poor, poor guy. You know, nobody wants to hang out with the, the jock. I mean, hell, I'd hang out with the dude. He sounds like a pretty cool guy, you know? He'd just have a couple beers. Well, in his case, have way too many beers. Um, <laughs> but, you know, I don't know. Just hang out. Go fishing. I don't know. I don't even know what he does. All, all I see him do in this game is just sit around and drink. But maybe he does other stuff. I don't know. Maybe he's like... A super cool poker champion. Maybe he could help me be the venti guy, you know? I don't know. 
Maybe he's like... Maybe he's like, uh... You know, we don't know much about Jock, and honestly, I want to know more about him. Why did he start drinking? Well, it's obviously pretty wise started drinking. He probably started drinking because of his wife. No offense. And because of the train, probably, because they, as he said, they put a train track to his house, and, well, it kind of made him go a little bit crazy. Not like, well, yeah, a little crazy. Uh, I mean, I would, too, if I had a train every not every freaking ten minutes. He's open. Awesome. My man, how you doing? Alright. Hopefully my, uh... 3300? Yo, I don't care what you have to say about my car, man. Your car's crap too, dog. Um, so that's about, that's not too bad. We've got like 14 grand to play around with here, so I I'm gonna go all out, man. I'm gonna go all out. Now, I don't know about the, should I get the final gear change, though? I mean, the stock final gear change is fine, I think, for the rally. I mean, people have suggested to get the, I think it's four point. Um, 110, which is a bit shorter geared, I will say, but I think 4.286 is fine. I've had good experience with it already, so, alright, uh, no, 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 we need no body work. Um, custom paint job by artists. Ooh, it's still not quite enough there. That is, that is a shame. That is a so much of a sh even with the 40% discount. I can't get that. Okay, that's that sucks. Well, all right. Um, rim polish. No, no, no rims, no tires. I think that's it. So, not too, not too bad. Yes, yes, yes. Whatever. I'm gonna work on my car for a little bit. You know, whatever. Um, so I guess, I guess we're going to here. So I'm gonna go home. And uh, I'll get back to y'all when he calls me back about the roll cage. And hopefully by then I'll have enough money to get the custom paint job. Actually, how much is, how much does rally tires cost? Actually, how much do those cost? Just just for future reference here. Um, oh, I can't order. Well, I can, look, I can look up on a wiki, so it's fine. But hopefully next time we come back, I'll have enough money to get the custom paint job. And some rally wheels, rally tires. So, until next time, I'll see y'all next time on my summer car. I'm really, you know, I, we're almost almost close to, you know, enough enough to get the rally started. But we got some work to do first. So, anyway, guys, see y'all next time. And I hear Pina. All right, hang on. I see him. I see the dust trail. I see him coming. See you next time. <laughs>